Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Esteem Stick. You are watching Artificial Intelligence course and we are working with natural language processing. Let's get started. In this tutorial, we are going to study building blocks of language, which are used in natural language processing. First one is phoneme, second is morpheme and lexemes, third is syntax and fourth is context. Phonemes. Phoneme is of sound. For example, B in banana, C in car and duck, D in dinosaur and puddle, F in fish and giraffe, and S in sun and mouse, T in turtle and little. And there are so many sounds. We call them phonemes. You can see all those in this table. Morphemes and lexemes. A morpheme is the smallest unit of language. That has a meaning. Not all morphemes are words, but all prefixes and suffixes are morphemes. For example, you can see in the table 1, some English morphemes are there. Kind, it has only one morpheme. Kindly, it has two morphemes. Unkind, it has two morphemes again. Unkindness, it also has three morphemes, as the name suggests. We can break the word in three parts, right? Now, if you can see in the figure, run, using the word run, we can create run, running and runs. But here, run is lexeme. We call it lexeme. This is a root word. Syntax. Syntax is a set of rules to construct grammatically correct sentences out of words and phrases in a language. It is represented using parse tree, as you can see in the figure on the left hand side below. A sentence can be divided into noun phrase and verb phrase. Noun phrase is a further divided into adjective and simple noun. On the other hand, verb phrase is divided into two parts, verb and noun phrase. Noun phrase again we can divide it as determinant and noun. Now we can see we have broken the sentence in words. We call it token. Like happy linguistics make a diagram. So this is a syntax. Now context. Context is how various parts in language come together to convey a particular meaning. Context is composed from semantics and pragmatic, pragmatics. Pragmatics and semantics, right? So semantics is the direct meaning of the word without external context. And pragmatics add external knowledge to enable us to infer the implied meaning. So we can see context is used in various NLP applications like sarcasm detection, summarization and topic modeling. Like, share and subscribe and please don't forget to hit the bell icon. We are really thankful that you are supporting us.